Good afternoon. It's two o'clock and four minutes on uh, 667 here. Uh, S class. Anyways, only had one class today. I think I mentioned the schedule last week. How uh, the the uh, writing class for this week is done from home and it's not any work because I'm caught up. So got to sleep till 11 and then go in from 12:30 to 1:45 and we got out early. So that's good. It's a beautiful day. It's just 60 degrees now at 2 o'clock, and there's not a cloud in the sky. So that is open, and I'm on my way home. I should be home in 30 minutes. Then I'm going to mow and then go take a hike with Kenan, and uh, it should be a nice fall day. Hope you're having a good one so far. Freaking hell, we got big dirty up here. Look at the size of those wheels, tires anyways. Diff's totally open in the back. Dual exhaust, nice. The F1 Fitty with two parking sensors or laser jammers or something on the outside of the bumper, I don't know. It's the BMW T3. It's a 330 E46. Looks like an older one due to the ambered out turn signal lights. Hey, buddy. It appears we have found a Z3M. Yes, we have. Not for a nice autumn cruise. I can almost get next to it, but I don't want to piss off the fur driver over here to my left. And we're in the falls, which is notorious for cops. I already got room now. See what kind of a specimen we have behind the wheel of this thing. Maybe he recognizes a powerful one car. Yeah, it looks like a Z3M driver. Looks nice nonetheless. I like the color. Nice car. Do we like what we see? Well, I say yes, it's got a sold sign in the window, so there's a little hint to where my lawn mowing money went this season. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I wish. That is the best color. That was probably the same one that was at uh, yeah, uh, Glenmore. Yeah, I think so. Looks excellent. Oh, I could film this all day. That color is perfect. Uh, the wheels are great. It's kind of the wrong interior for me. It's a little light and it's a uh, grandma speed. But aside from that, it's pretty perfect. X6. E60 over there. It's the wrong shirt for this place, dude. I don't have a nice uh, it E88 and a bunch of E92s, so we're gonna see what else they have going on here. Holy freaking shit, look at this guy's parking. Really hope he's not around here taking a shit in the woods or something to hear me. But, I mean, th this guy, this guy in the Outback did better than that guy in the Outback. All right, boys, leash all pets, and uh, we're doing this 3.2 miles. Well, guys, as you can see, it, um, it has gotten a little dark here in the woods. Time check. I can barely read this. 7-11. Uh, 7-11 p.m. Uh, we've been walking for, let's see, this is the end, huh? uh, almost an hour. By the time we get to this sign, it'll be about an hour. The sign weren't in the way, you'd be able to see our grade A parking lot of gravel. There's there one car in the parking lot. There she be. All right, boys and girls, just had dinner at uh, Rockney's. It was really good and uh, very poorly parked, uh, the Volkswagen R8. I saw what I thought was an E46 M3, but it's not. I only see two exhaust tips on the left. Darn it. It's a modified. It's got some different wheels. 330. Still very nice. Nice and clean. I like that. We'll see what kind of trans he's got going on in here. And it is an automatic. Never mind. If that's not the most flattering shot of me that you have ever seen, tell me what it is. Evening status update, uh, YouTube, there we go. Two over there that need to get done, as well as a few emails, so that's no problem. It's 11.33 p.m., today was an awesome day. Got in a nice walk, Hampton Hills, if anybody knows. Uh, it's according to the, see if I have that paper in my wallet. Um, it's one of the harder walks on this Metro Park thing that we do. It's rated a three, which means it's uh, a harder one as opposed to a one or two, and it's like three point something miles. Uh, Hampton Hills, Hampton Hills, right there, Adam Run Trail, 3.2 miles, rated a three. Uh, so we got that done today. There's another hard one on here that we did last year. Uh, Goodyear Heights, we already did. Sand Run, and looks like those are the only threes. There's three threes on here, so maybe we'll go find some hard ones that we did last year and do those just because they're 
little bit more challenging and longer, and they're, and they're actually more fun. There's a lot of hills and steps and stuff, so it's interesting. Filmed a little bit of that. Uh, dinner with Ken and Rockneys. Then uh, we saw the, the M5s today. I didn't film the other M5s because it was in their service bay, and I felt like we weren't supposed to be walking around back there anyways. Uh, but it was kind of a light gray. Here, I'll find it online for you. Okay, here it is. 2013 <clears throat> F10 M5. I looked at it on cars.com the other day, and then I came here to... Uh, DaveWalterBMW.com and looked at it, and it kind of looked like a really light blue to me, like a Silverstone. Um, on the E39, the Silverstone metallic, which is what mine is, is kind of a, a light blue silver metallic uh, color. It's, I like it. Um, and then with the E60 M5, they went to Silverstone, and it was kind of, they took the blue out of it, so it was more of a silver, kind of like the um, titanium silver metallic on the E39. And now this one I thought was kind of that light blue, or the Silverstone from the E60, but I saw it in person today in the garage, and it's definitely more of a gray. So now looking at it on DaveWalterBMW.com, they have the color listed as Space Gray, which, uh, Dad, is the same color as the X5. So, um, it doesn't look like it, though. Tell me. Tell me on the phone next time I talk to you. That does not look like the color of the X5. Anyways, that was cool. It had the same wheels as the one that I filmed out front. Um, the M6. Didn't see it today. They said it was there. I talked to the service guy I know there. I believe his name is Adam. And um, he said it was there, but I didn't see it. So anyways, I've seen a couple F12, F11, M6. M6 is the F12, the convertible. A couple in San Diego, a few here. Uh, so that was cool. Anyways, great day. Uh, what else? I wanted to just do a little poll here in the video. Where did you find my videos? How do you know who I am? And why do you keep coming back every day to watch my enthralling life? Um, obviously that's why I do this. A lot of it's just for me, so I can look back in 20 years and, and see where I came from when I'm an ultra millionaire, you know? So, um, did you know me from the Tech Cores days? From the original 50 days of vlogs that I did? From Ryan Knows Tech on YouTube? Facebook. Where do you know me from? Leave me a comment. How did you find these videos and why are you here? Just a little interesting thing that I'd like to read when I wake up tomorrow morning and start perusing through my emails from bed. Speaking of which, tomorrow, hmm, kind of a longer day tomorrow. Wednesday, I've got to be there for math. We're taking our final exam in the math course. So the semester is right about halfway done right now. The semester is made up of two classes, Algebra 2 and then Algebra 3. So I'm finishing the Algebra 2 and taking the online exam tomorrow. Then we have like a week off. I'm hoping that means we don't need to come to class, which would make my Mondays and Wednesdays awesome. Like my Fridays, one class, the best class of all, 1.10 to 2 o'clock. And we always get out of there at like 1.40. So that would be awesome if we can do that. But tomorrow i got to be there early at 8.50 which means getting up at 7.30, which is too early for me. Um, and then I have an a, um, advising appointment at like 11 or 11.30. I don't actually know when the time is, so I sent my advisor an email. I haven't heard back from her yet, so I'll have to go in tomorrow if she doesn't reply and figure that out. And then I have the physics class from 1.10 to 2. So that's tomorrow. Other than that, I don't really know. I mowed across the street today. I need to mow here. I need to mow next door. They want me to plant some bushes and put some mulch down before winter comes over there. So I've kind of got stuff to do. If it doesn't rain, I'll do that tomorrow. Thursday, uh, got a couple things going on Thursday, and then Friday will be awesome again. So, uh, without talking your head off tonight, uh, leave me those comments if you could, please. And I'll talk to you tomorrow, 6.68. Good night. Thanks for watching.